What's up? This is Jake with Hike 734, hiking with my wife, Kristen, here in Zion National Park. Today we did the Narrows from the bottom up to Big Spring and then back. So anyways, now we're heading our, on our way back on the Riverside Walk, which is where it starts. And uh, yeah, you just kind of walk along the Virgin River until it starts to, the canyon starts to close up. And then from there, you uh, get into the water. And so um, it was, it's really a busy trail, uh, as you can see by all the people, um, but it's awesome. If you've never done the Narrows, and you've been to, and you're planning on going to Zion. You need to go ahead and check it out because it's fantastic. And um, as you're heading on up, you can uh, see a little waterfall, um, and then it just it just keeps getting uh, more and more closed in. Um, the canyon starts to get tighter and tighter, and then it's just incredible for a really long time. And then it starts to open back up, and then you get to Big Spring. But I'm just going to go ahead and show you a lot of footage of the Narrows and just let you take a look at how awesome it is. So anyways, this is Jake and Kristen with Hike 734, just doing a little bit of Narrows in Zion National Park. And so enjoy the footage of the Narrows.
Um, a couple of final notes on the Narrows is if you do it from the bottom up and then come back, you don't need a permit, so that's one thing. The second thing is I highly recommend one of these poles right here. Um, you can go, oh, are we showing them? There we go. Um, I recommend a couple, one of these poles just because it's really great with the rocks are really big and kind of like bowling balls. So I definitely would recommend getting one of those. And then also um, you want to have closed toed water shoes and just get ready to get like wet. Um, depending upon, you know, then, then the standard, you know, flash flood warnings, make sure you're aware of have the temperature, how cold everything is going to be, um, if there's going to be flash floods or anything like that. And so make sure that you're always being safe. And, um, you know, but if the, if the level's good and there's no flash flood, you have closed toed shoes, your pole, you should be good to go and uh, enjoy the Narrows. So anyways, we'll wrap this up. This is Jake with Hike 734 with Kristen. This is the Narrows.